is Shamrock. Miss LeBeau is my human. I would like to share a book with you. It's called, What If You Had an Animal Tail? I have a tail. It's long and black and has a tiny little white spot at the tip. What if one day when you woke up, threw back the covers and got out of bed, something felt different? What if overnight you'd grown a wild animal's tail? <gasps> Today, we are going to talk about a peacock. A male peacock has a tail with feathers up to six feet long that can fan across its back. The feathers have eye like, eye like? Oh, like my eye. The feathers have eye like spots in beautiful colors like blue, green, and gold. This bird sheds, ooh, I shed too. This bird sheds and regrows its tail feathers each year just in time for the mating season. The peacock uses them to win a female mate called a peahen. The bigger the fantail and the more eye spots displayed, the better the peacock has a chance of finding a mate. Fun fact! Each peacock's tail has its own special pattern of eye spots and shimmering colors. If you had a peacock's tail, fans would always flock to see you. Thanks for listening! It's recess time, and today I'm at Charles Park in Middleburg, and this has a lot to give you. We have a park, a dog park, and a pond. Check it out. boys and girls and welcome to Animal Antics with Linda. Well, we all like to have snacks, don't we? So this next question was, what's the strangest thing you've had to do to get a snack? Peter, who's 10, said, find it in the woods. Aubriana, who's five, said, I don't know. And John, who's nine, he said, boil water in a can over a fire. That's pretty strange, isn't it? Well, in the dry, scrubby lands of North Africa, desperate measures are sometimes needed to reach food for goats. And you can pretend this is a goat. It's the nearest thing I had. The padded hoofs that help them clamber over rocks can be put to good work in reaching the leaves in trees. Goats are expert balancers, but some branches are easier to get to than others. The region's argon trees are like a magnet to the goats because of their tasty olive-like berries. Most goats will attempt to climb even the thinnest of branches of these trees to reach the topmost fruits. You see the goats there? I don't think I've ever seen a goat climb a tree. Okay, so until next time, bye bye. Thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.